Now, words in consciousness are very important. Proverbs also talks about that there's power. Life and death is found in the power of the tongue. Your words matter. They matter. And that's why I speak life into my body. I'm not going to let the circumstances dictate my life. I will, in a sense, run, of course, with the wisdom and the grace of God. I'll know that I can live a good life that's prosperous and satisfying. You're speaking it into existence. The Bible says that God spoke in Romans chapter 4, that God spoke things that are not as though they were. And many of us are speaking things into existence that are negative. Your consciousness, what you believe, will affect your environment. It will affect your surroundings. That's why I speak life. I'm rich. I'm prosperous. We have more than enough. We have more than enough. Why? Because if I only had enough, I cannot give. Right? These are the things, folks, we need to speak life. You know, there's a saying that says, that which you resist will persist. If you are always against something, it's going to keep on going. Focus on the positive. Change your words. I am healthy, I'm strong, I'm living life of abundance. My parents are strong, my parents are well. Today's going to be a good day. And I visualize my day. It's going to be a good day. It's a good day. When you start changing the way you think, then your circumstances will start to change. But it always starts here.